Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel Cyber Money. Today we will discuss how to write research paper in LaTeX. Uh, at this stage, I am assuming that you have installed TechMaker and you have also installed JBREF for references. Uh, I have separate video for this, like installation, installing TechMaker and JBREF for references. Uh, afterwards, just open the TechMaker, like open the TechMaker and make a new file, and just come. Uh, I'll just go through this step by step. First, we have to do is uh, write a document class uh, this will show up the size of the text and then the type of the article or um, the write up that you are using you are you can write article you can even write i triple e tron and uh, currently this is a single column uh, template if you are using i triple e transaction format and that will be a double column like normally the research paper that we see is are in i triple e transaction double column format so you can see this is changed to double column so it's totally up to you then you have to write the title just write slash title and uh, whatever you want to write within the title let's say a, a cyber money beauty video for page so this will change up the title from here you can see the title is changed now next you have to do is uh, just write the author uh, write author and uh, slash author and the name and for the affiliation of author you can use thanks uh, this is the name of the author and this is the affiliation so that's how you can make a title afterwards what you have to do uh, make sure to write make title this will make the title and then if i want to write add the abstract just write begin abstract and abstract goes here So uh, this is basically uh, how I'll add the abstract in the IEEE format. What if I want to change it to simple article format? Just write article. I'll try to copy something in the abstract as well, just to show there's abstract. So you can see the abstract over here. The next you have to, uh, I'll just change it to IEEE transaction format to make a double column you can see the abstract next if i want to add a section just try section and name of the section let's say don't write section star just write section and introduction and i'll paste the same thing in the introduction so this will make up the introduction section but if I want to add up a reference, I just have to go to JBREF to add this reference. Currently, I have added this reference using the BibTech source key from the Google Scholar. I have a separate video over it. And I'll just write slash site and write the reference that I have used in the JBREF. I have named the reference as Hassan01. So this will be the same reference. Uh, I'll just go and click LaTeX. Then I'll click BibTech and then LaTeX and then BibTech and then I'll compile. So you can see this reference is added out here. Reference one and the reference uh, was over here. Previously, I've previously compiled the document, so therefore it was showing before. But if I'll just hide this up, it will not show. Uh, this is how to add the sections uh, if I want to add another section let's say section literature review and I'll just copy the same thing and then another section sorry problem formulation and then I'll copy the similar thing. So you can see uh, the research paper will look introduction, literature review, problem formulation. There is another thing. But if I want to just uh, like uh, add any equation over here, just write begin equation. So this will uh, add a new equation. Let's say x square plus y square is equal to z square. So this will add an equation just like this uh, you can even label the equation as label 
pqn1 and then you can cite this equation afterwards from here let's say not cite you have to use the reference eqn then the same procedure latex Tech. this is basically just for uh, recompiling and then we'll go for so now you can see the reference for the equation is added here uh, normally it is written as eqn dot So this is equation number one and this is equation number one so we are citing equation here similarly if you want to add up a table just write begin table and within the begin table you have to use tabular begin tabular and how many number of column let's say two columns this will basically just uh, add vertical lines i have to also use a package over here use package tabular if I'm using tabular then within this table uh, I can just write uh, table 0 1 and to make a new column just write and table 0 2 and this will make a new table uh, it is giving me error uh, what error it is giving me tabular oh okay so I guess it's not required at the moment in the new versions okay so uh, this table is added right here uh, similarly uh, what if I want to add a new line in this table just write double slash and write table 03 and table 04 this will add up a new line so this table you can see if I want a horizontal line, I'll just write H line. You can see that uh, lines are added. So these are some basic things that you require while you are writing a research paper. Uh, I have also made certain other videos regarding each step like uh, how to enumerate, how to add figures, how to add tables. You can check out my channel and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye.